This tutorial shows the step-by-step -step instructions for this lesson in the Omega Learning Guide. At the end of this lesson, your job should look something like this. Select the Toes or Text on the Work Surface option by clicking on the arrow in the lower right-hand corner of the Text Tool icon. The pointer changes to the Text Eye Beam and the Text Toolbar appears. This is a dockable menu that you can place on the work surface or add to your menu bars. Click the down arrow to the right of the Select Fonts list. A drop-down list of all available fonts will open. Scroll through the list by clicking and dragging the slider bar down the list until you find Futura Display. The font style will be displayed to the right of the list. Click on it to make it the active font. Double-click the Font Height text box in the text toolbar. Enter 3 and press Enter to set the font height. Click anywhere on the work surface, then type Grand Opening. Don't worry if your text is out of view. To view the entire design, press the space bar or use the Zoom to All feature in the Zoom toolbar. To display the Zoom toolbar, select Toolbars in the View menu and click on Zoom. This is a useful toolbar to have, so let's dock it up top for later use. Click on the Zoom to All button to center your design in the screen. With the text option still selected, press Enter to move the cursor to the next line. Type May 8. You can double-click on a word to quick select it or click and drag to select multiple words. Select May 8 and double-click on the font height text box. Type 2.5 and press Enter to change the font size. Now highlight the text Grand Opening. Click Text, Change Case, and select Uppercase to change the text to all capital letters. Place the cursor anywhere on the first line of text. Turn on character spacing by clicking on the button on the text toolbar. A blue dotted line appears on three sides of the text with two corner handles. Place the pointer on either corner handle located on the sides of the text. Click and drag the handles to expand or contract the text spacing. When you are finished, turn off character spacing by clicking on the button in the text toolbar. Now would be a good time to save your progress so far. Click File, Save As, and locate your main hard drive. Find the Jobs folder and open it. Click on the Create New Folder button to create a new folder where you can keep your learning guide jobs. Enter the folder name as My Lessons and double-click to open it. In the Filed Name text box, type Grand Opening for the name of the job and make sure you select PLT Gerber Plot File as the file type. Click Save and your job should be saved in your new folder. This concludes this lesson. Be sure to check if there are any exercises or tip videos associated with this lesson before continuing. For more information on this and other topics, please consult the Omega Help File or press F1 in Composer.